In Vanderbilt University's Computer Science Graduate Program, we are creating a better future by tackling the big problems of the present. In computer science, we have research that focuses on human-computer interaction, virtual environments and graphics, algorithms, software engineering, medical imaging, and robotics. So my research is focusing on developing intelligent capabilities and interaction capabilities for robotic systems. We've uh, worked specifically with local first responders to try to understand how robots could be integrated into first response. Robotics research is highly interdisciplinary, requiring capabilities not only in computer science, but electrical engineering, mechanical engineering, systems engineering, human factors. So we've had collaborations for the last six years with Massachusetts Institute of Technology, Stanford University, University of Washington, University of Massachusetts. We also currently have collaborations going on with Carnegie Mellon University and the University of Southern California. Our research is very well funded. Compared to the top 10 or 20 programs, you'll find that our faculty actually are funded as well, if not better, than most of those programs. At ISIS, the Institute for Software Integrated Systems, we're working on improving the electronic devices we depend on every day. Nowadays, we're using a lot of mobile devices, like uh, smartphones, iPhones, uh, tablet, I like iPad. We're trying to optimize the system utilization of the wireless network and wireless communication so that it gives the user a much smoother user experience. Already known as one of the nation's premier graduate schools for medical imaging, graduate students at ISIS are now creating the next frontier in medical technology. We're trying to design an integrated design environment for non-technical users to use and build um, capsule robots, endoscopic robots that go inside your body and collect sensory information. The work being done at ISIS in software-reliant systems that are networked, computational, and physical has helped solidify Vanderbilt University's reputation as a premier research institution. Another area of work that we do at ISIS relates to engineering so-called resilient systems, systems where the right answer delivered too late becomes the wrong answer. And so it's our ability to marry research and practice and then cut across different disciplinary boundaries that really allows us to have the kind of impact that we have here at Vanderbilt and at ISIS. Today, ISIS is a national hub with international influence in the areas of cyber physical systems, cyber security, and model integrated computing. There's a great quote by the philosopher Thucydides, who once said, a person who has knowledge but lacks the ability to express it to others is no better off than a person with no knowledge at all. And I think that's a good philosophy that underlies a lot of what we do. We have people at Vanderbilt and at ISIS who are very, very deep theoretically. They have fantastic math and science skills, but they want to be able to do more. They want to be able to give back. They want to be able to make an impact and, be, and make a difference. And that's very unprecedented. How cool would it be if you could advance the frontiers of science, get a great paying job, and have it all be based on the technology of video games? The video game industry is now bigger than Hollywood. I have uh, former students who are working at Activision, which is one of the big uh, game companies, and at DreamWorks, which is one of the big uh, movie companies. If computer science professor Robert Bodenheimer has his way, Silicon Valley 2.0 might be in Nashville, Tennessee. His leading-edge work in virtual environments is redefining virtual reality. Think about a video game that now you could see that you're inside the video game and you turn around and see yourself inside the video game from all angles and everything. That's an immersive virtual environment. And what we want to do is to enable you to be in that environment and to learn something from that environment or to train in that environment and have that training transfer to the real world. That's the research that I do. And while your work might be in the virtual world, the job opportunities once you graduate are very real. In computer science, we have a really high placement rate and we have no problems uh, for our graduates getting, getting job opportunities. Industry tends to suck them all up immediately. Medical imaging, robotics, virtual worlds. At Vanderbilt, the future really is whatever you make of it. Insight, innovation, impact. Vanderbilt School of Engineering.